If, oh, you want to go on Accutane? That's awesome. Are you a person who can get pregnant? You are? Are you an idiot? Don't. Even with all these warnings, there are still thousands of Accutane exposed pregnancies every year, but what happens after? Well, there is no safe level of Accutane for a fetus as being exposed can cause abnormalities in their face, eyes, ears, cardiovascular, neurological system development, as well as low IQ under 85. Many of those pregnancies do end in miscarriage, but because of those risks, it's generally advised to abort the pregnancy. But how many do depend on where in the world you are? Like if you're in Germany, around 45% of these pregnancies will end up with an induced abortion as attitude support, trying to reduce the suffering to the fetus if they were born. But if you're in, say, the United States, where anti-abortion sentiment is more common and this is more likely to be seen as, say, God's plan, then that number is significantly lower, being at around 17% of pregnancies. These stats are also from before Roe versus Wade being overturned. So even though states who ban abortions do have exemptions, some of these lack specific details on fetal anomaly as they're mainly to save the life of the pregnant person. Would you want to continue with an Accutane pregnancy? Let us know.